Hey guys, this is Satya. Hope you all are doing well today. Today in our Excel tips, we are going to learn about a new function called replace. Now let's see what this replace function will do. What does it do? This function replaces a portion of text with a new piece of text. You need to specify where the replacement should start, how many characters to remove and what the new replacement text should be. Syntax for the same would be is equal to replace open bracket original text comma start position comma number of characters to be replaced comma the new text. So now let's see how to use this particular function. I have a sample data over here wherein this is my original text on the, on the first column and then if you want to utilize a replace function or if you want to apply a replace function we would need three different cells to be identified first. The first is the start position has to be mentioned. Second is characters to be replaced has to be mentioned. And the third is the new character which you, are, you, you would like to go ahead and replace. These are the three new columns which has to be added before you applying this particular formula. So now let's see how to apply this. The formula for the same is replace open bracket select the first original text comma the start position comma the number of characters to be replaced comma the new character that is the new text close the bracket and enter so in this way you will be able to get the replace text now let's identify the change here it is mentioned as a b c d e f g h and here the final text the replace text is a y y d e f g h so now let's see some kind of changes on this particular data I have mentioned the start position as 2. Let, let's assume I will change this to 1. Now if you see, it is changed. A is replaced with YY. And the rest all characters are same. The, we do not find B as well over here because the number of characters to be replaced that which you have provided over here is 2. Now let's see, keep it as 1. See here, only A is replaced with YY. And if you want to change this to 3 as well, or 4 as well or 5 it is it depends on our requirement what we are looking for an output so in this way you will be able to go ahead and do this and the new character that which you would like to go ahead and give will be it is up to you I just want old I'm just writing old so old D E F G H so in this way you will be able to change the positions and you can replace the number of characters as well And you can write whatever the new character you would like to see as an output. So in this way, you will be able to apply the replace formula in a huge data. If it is a small data, you can go ahead and change it manually. But if it is a huge data and if you want to get the replaced thing with the new uh, text, you will have to apply this particular replace formula, which is very simple. The formula for the same would be, the syntax for the same would be, is equal to replace, open bracket, select the original text, comma, select the start position, comma, select the number of characters to be replaced comma new character and close the bracket you will get the data so this is how you will go ahead and apply a replace formula so i hope you all have loved and you all have uh, liked this particular video and understand the concept of replace thank you for watching this video and please do subscribe for our channel and please like the channel as well and please post your valuable comments as well thank you so much